Alright, what's up everyone? Mr. Noob 2 Gamer. Today we're playing Call of Duty Black Ops 4 four years later. Two weeks ago today was the four year anniversary, October 12, 2018. A very divisive and polarizing game in the Call of Duty series. A lot of people didn't think that Black Ops 4 was very good and think it's one of the worst Call of Duty games of all time. And I just want to ask those people, have you ever played Modern Warfare? Do you really think that Modern Warfare is better? I mean, there's some people. It's just crazy how the opinions are so varied in the community. Some people think that Modern Warfare is one of the best. I think it's the absolute worst Call of Duty game ever made by far. And I think Black Ops 4 is a top five Call of Duty game. I think it's one of the greatest Call of Duty games of all time. I think it's the greatest Call of Duty game to be released on the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. And it is perhaps the most underrated game in the entire Call of Duty series. I'm not saying that Black Ops 4 is perfect. And it's not without its problems. For starters, it kind of runs like shit. It's very slow. It takes a very long time to load in. And it just seems like it's not very stable. Like, it kind of sometimes feels like I'm playing an alpha more than a full game. Just with how laggy and slow and the frames constantly dropping. Not to a point where it's unplayable, but it does happen a lot more frequently than any other Call of Duty game that I've ever played. But I love the specialists. I love the balancing of the game because yes, it's very unbalanced. That's what I want from a Call of Duty game. Modern Warfare 2 is some of the most fun I've ever had in Call of Duty. And it was a complete unbalanced mess. Black Ops 4, it, it's a lot different from Modern Warfare 2 with the specialists and all that stuff. But I really like, when I think of Black Ops 4, it actually reminds me a lot of Modern Warfare 2 just with how overpowered everything is and how ridiculous the streaks are how it's just the cheesiest game ever and i love it so much i mean that's what video games are all about it's about having fun i have fun when everything is over the top and ridiculous not when you have this skill-based matchmaking shit where it feels like an esports tournament and i'm sweating my ass off every single game that's not how i want to play call of duty no i want to actually enjoy myself i want a fun casual experience that I could just pick up and not think too hard about you know like it's just called it's call of duty it's not supposed to take itself seriously it never was then this change all of a sudden it started with modern warfare 2019 where they had strict SBMM in every single game broke up lobbies all this bullshit it's like no that's not what I want so you know when, when modern warfare came out I ended up playing a lot more black ops 4 than Modern Warfare 2019, and I grew to love it over the years. I haven't played it in several months just because of how busy I've been. I haven't even posted on YouTube, um, but I've heard a lot of things on Reddit about how Black Ops 4 is unplayable, how the servers are, like, there's something wrong with the servers and no one can connect to a game. People have mentioned that on Discord and Reddit and all over the place. So I finally decided to log in and check out because I'm like, Oh man, if Black Ops 4 is unplayable, I'm literally going to cry because it's one of my favorite games. You know, it, it works fine, at least on Xbox One, it works completely fine. I have no issues with the servers, at least no more issues than I had during the game's prime. So, yeah, no, I it's completely playable. People are still playing. I was playing at, I think it was like 5 o'clock in the morning and I was able to get full servers instantly. So, you still have a pretty strong community. Of course, they hide the player counts. You know, you used, back in the day, you used to have player counts in Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 1. I think Call of Duty Ghosts was the last Call of Duty game to have public player counts in, in the game. But, yeah, I don't know exactly how many people were playing, but it's definitely a lot. You have all of these different game modes. It's not just Team Deathmatch. With DLC that people are still playing. People are still playing Zombies 2, even though people were shitting on that game mode. I thought it was fine. Definitely, you know, after playing Vanguard Zombies recently, I'm like, oh man, Black Ops War Zombies is actually pretty kick-ass in comparison. Although, doesn't say much, but... No, I, I actually, you know, even with the Zombies, I didn't think it was as bad as everyone was saying. Blackout was a lot of fun, I think is better than Warzone. And unfortunately, though, with, with Blackout, no one's playing that. It's completely dead. I've tried multiple times to get a game going, and it's just... No, doesn't work. So, if you want your Blackout fix, you're going to have to play COD Mobile Battle Royale because you have a lot more players on there, and it uses essentially the same map as the Black Ops 4 Battle Royale with Blackout. Definitely give this game a try. I'm sure you've heard a lot of bad things about it, but there are a lot of instances in video games where I have heard so many bad things about a game 
And then when I play it, I'm like, oh my god, this game is amazing. I don't know what people are thinking, like why they hate it so much. I love it. So keep an open mind if you're gonna th if you're thinking about coming into Black Ops 4. It plays nothing like Cold War, as you can probably tell with the gameplay. So if you're coming from Cold War and expecting Black Ops 4 to be similar, uh-uh, definitely not. And Black Ops 3, I mean, it's pretty much Black Ops 3 without jetpacks, with higher health, a slower time to kill, and less shitty microtransactions. Actually, the microtransactions are completely fine in Black Ops 4. In Black Ops 3, there's still cancer, and that's why I stopped playing that game. So, yeah, overall, I'd rank Black Ops 4 pretty high among all the Call of Duty games. Just the fun factor alone, it's a really fun game. Some of the most fun I've ever had in all of Call of Duty, and I've been playing Call of Duty for, what, 13, 14 years now? It's a really good game, and I still feel that way four years later. Let me know what's your opinion on Black Ops 4. Did you love it? Did you hate it? How would you rank it among all the Call of Duty games that we have had? Let me know in the comments down below. As always, thank you all for watching, and I will catch you guys later. Peace.